I grew up in Texas. I went to the University of Texas at Arlington where I received my Bachelor of Science in Biology in the year 2010. From there, I went to medical school in Galveston, Texas at the University of Texas Medical Branch where I graduated in 2014 with my medical degree. I then came to Shreveport and did my internal medicine residency at LSU, followed by my cardiology fellowship. And then from there, I went to the Mayo Clinic in Phoenix and completed my electrophysiology fellowship. I'm a cardiac electrophysiologist. I primarily take care of heart rhythm disorders, which includes performing procedures to take care of cardiac arrhythmias. I also implant cardiac devices such as pacemakers and defibrillators. During my cardiology fellowship, I was exposed to electrophysiology and I realized that I enjoyed taking care of arrhythmias. Patients feel much better after they have their arrhythmia resolved or have their pacemaker implanted, and you can also try to prevent sudden cardiac death with defibrillators. One area that I do focus on is atrial fibrillation. The risk of atrial fibrillation does increase with age, so we do have a large patient population that has atrial fibrillation. Other arrhythmias that I treat besides atrial fibrillation are atrial flutter, SVT, also known as supraventricular tachycardia, and premature ventricular contractions, also known as PVCs, and ventricular tachycardia. I believe in patient-centered care, that we are all here to serve the needs of the patient first. Um, from the physician to the nurses to anybody working with the patient, our goal is to make them feel comfortable and safe. I think the biggest motivator for me is helping the patient feel better overall. A lot of times a patient will have something like atrial fibrillation and their overall life and quality of life becomes limited because of the symptoms from their condition. And being able to help that patient feel better when they're in normal rhythm is incredibly gratifying for me.